Look what we have here guys, a Euro 2020 mod for FIFA 21 with customized menus and everything and even like a super cool cutscene that I think I'll have to skip otherwise I may get like a copyright strike or something but it is super cool man honestly this might be my favorite mod of the year. This mod just gives you access to like the Euro tournament which is super amazing like you can actually play I'm pretty sure the Euro 2020s or even the Euro under 21 tournament, which is again, a really cool addition. Of course, this mod doesn't have career mode or anything. So it's just the tournament mode in FIFA. So that is a bit of a bummer, but really I'm, I'm pretty impressed, man. This guy who's made it has put in a lot of effort with the menus and all super cool um, facts coming up under Benzema. And uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's pretty amazing. That's what I'll say. So in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at this mod, seeing what it's all about going through maybe a few games in the Euros, so should be fun. You guys know how FIFA don't have the licenses for all the Euro teams, like not Macedonia, who've managed to qualify for the first time for the Euros. Well, this mod fixes that. All of those teams are in this, Croatia included, so all the official teams are in it, and even with the squad. So for example, if I pop up, um, let's go with um, Croatia to check it out. They've got like the official lineups, kits as well, this mod is fully decked out, man, and I'm loving it. There's also like a way you can get icons for the Euros to have a bit of fun. So for example, I've just loaded up the icon squads. And now if I go to, let's say, let's go with Belgium. No, no, Belgium now. Let's go with England, I guess. You guys can see there's Gary Lineker, David Beckham, Lampard, and all the English legends in here. So... That is a super cool addition, but for this video, I think we'll stick with the regular squads. So for this video, guys, we'll be going through a Euro tournament run. Should be fun. I'm not going to be playing all the games. We'll probably play one game or something like that. So there's that. But let me know in the comments section if you guys want to see like a mini series going through a Euros tournament with one of the teams. I think it could be a lot of fun. Maybe something like a challenge with North Macedonia. Imagine the struggle. Let me know in the comments section if you guys think that'd be a good idea. Drop a like if you're excited for some Euro tournament. 2020 or 2021 content subscribe if you're new around here and let's get things underway time to go through a tournament run we're gonna of course select the normal euro 2020 and now time to select the team so I've, I've just had a consultation as you could say with my twitch chat and england was what i was gonna go with but that kind of seems a little boring chat let's do something different italy are in incredible form let's go with italy chat let's go with italy and that's what we're gonna run with for today's video we're gonna be italy and let's see how far we can go in this tournament run and just see how this mod runs the tournament system guys this is actually insane look at the menus there's also like a draw kind of graphic that shows you all the groups. This is insane. Yo, this is actually insane. Fair enough. Whoever made this mod, I'll have a link in the description for it. But this is, this is a big dub. This is a big dub. As you guys can see, all the groups are completely official and everything. And it's got like the graphics and all. Our squads here, which we'll be taking a look at. I'm already in love with this mod. This is insane. Okay, so the squad I think is already set up. We're just gonna run with the default setup a 4-3-3. Immobile is having a decent Euro, so is Insignia. But I think the most impressive player is this man on the bench, Locatelli. He's really lighting things up. He's only 23. I bet he's gonna secure like a big money move somewhere soon with the way he's playing. The defense, of course, the Italians rocking an insane defense. For the first time in a long time, the Italians are going into a tournament without Gigi Buffon, guys. So, yeah, Donnarumma starts here. Is he in the squad? No, we don't have Buffon, guys. Okay, so that's what we're rocking for the Euros now. We're going to sim through the group stages. I reckon we should finish top. We'll play a couple of games through this Euros run. By the way, Turkey, they were supposed to be the dark horses, man. What happened? They're pretty much already knocked out. Let's see what we can do against Turkey in the first one. Italy won this convincingly. What? <laughs> guys, I'm... Um, yeah, okay. Well, at least on FIFA, they consider the Dark Horses because they just beat us. Kaveki scored. Yup, this wasn't supposed to happen. Okay, we go into game two with Switzerland. If we lose this, I think we're out of the Euros or we'll have to win the last game and hope that we go through. Please, just get me a draw here. 
Okay, why did I ask for a draw? Guys, what? I thought Italy were gonna win the Euros or like get far in the tournament. Okay, boys, um, what's happening here? No way am I gonna get knocked out of the Euros. What do I do now? I think we gotta play this game against Wales. Yeah, I think we gotta play this one. Third still go through, I think. I, I think we gotta play it. Okay, for the final game against Wales, we'll we'll do the full simulation thing. And if we're still losing at halftime, we'll hop in and try and win the game, okay? We're playing for our lives right here, guys. Okay? It's it's a big one. Let's see, guys. Let's try this out. Come on, boys. Come on. Oh. Let's go, boys. We scored Florenzi coming up with the goods. That's a big goal for us. That's a big goal. Oh, what a relief. What a relief. I'm jumping to result, guys. Let's get it done. And it's a 1-0 win. That should send us through. I think. Switzerland-Turkey draw, which means they're on five each. We should go through. We do go through. Switzerland, Turkey, Italy. I think Finland... Do Finland go through? I think they will. France should survive the drop. Okay, so Poland and Czech Republic are getting knocked out. Round of 16. Turkey, Denmark. Denmark through. Switzerland knocked out Netherlands. Italy, Austria. We get a fairly lucky... North Macedonia survived. How did that happen? And these are the other games. Oh my god. England, Portugal and Spain, France. Yikes. We should be able to get through... Austria at least or at least we can hope so guys we're gonna do the um, full quick sim again against Austria they've got a good team in a few positions Alaba at the back as well come on boys come on half time if we're struggling we'll hop in to try and win it okay that's the plan come on boys we make the goal with Lorenzo Insigne come on one nil up against Austria uh, I think if we jump the result now we should oh we get a 3-0 win Insigne Spinazzola adding to it we go into the next round of the Euros, guys. Come on. Okay, guys, this is where the tournament gets serious. Denmark, Switzerland, Italy, Belgium, Croatia, Germany, Portugal, Spain. So Portugal knocked out England. It's not coming home. It's not coming home. Spain knocked out France. Damn. I think I'm going to play this one against Belgium, guys. Maybe. I'm not sure. All right. So it's time to test out this game mode, guys, by playing a game. That's probably the best way to do it. So... That is the team um, we're, we're going to be rocking in this tournament. I'm thinking, do we start Chiesa over Berardi? I think we do. The pace, the pace, the pace. The pace. We'll play Chiesa. And also, I know you guys are going to lose it if I don't make it ultimate difficulty. So, there you go. Ultimate difficulty, competitive mode, everything's normal. Let's try and win the Euros by getting past Belgium. Okay, look at the graphics and all, man. The kits are all there. The fans are there. The branding is there. Hey, this is perfect. National anthems as well in the game. Love to see it, boys. Love to see it. And look at this. There, there should be the, like, official scoreboards for the Euros. Look at the top left of your screen. There you go. This is nutty. Oh, my God. That almost went in. Donnarumma was strong there. Lukaku charging in like that. Go on, Marco. Immobile. Oh, what a run. Barella. Barella. Hey, let's go. Easy business. Italy won. Belgium nil. It's Nico Barella scoring for us in the Euros. You love to see it. You love to see it. What a strike. Simple, man. Immobile was so useful there to play it back to Insigne. Look at that. And then the pass. Lovely goal, boys. Lovely goal. We're coming for the Euros. We're coming for the Euros. Oh, look at this counter. Look at this counter. Chiesa breaking through. Immobile's run is insane. Has to score. Easy. 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 Immobile. Immobilizing the Belgium defense. Superb. The pace of Chiesa there. What a finish as well. Courtois is no easy keeper. No easy keeper to, uh, to get past. 2 nil up, Italy. We're destroying them, guys. Let's go. Okay, okay, guys. We might be scoring another one. What is happening here? Guys, have Belgium forgot to play football? Guys, you saw me put it on ultimate with competitor mode on. We're going to jump to result, guys. There's no way we're losing this now. Yeah, 3-0. Unreal. Well, that was easy. Semi-finals of the Euros. Here we come. Okay, so quarterfinals done. Switzerland through against Denmark. We knocked out Belgium. Germany going through, of course. Portugal knocking out Spain. 
Is it going to be Euro 2016 all over again? Germany, Portugal, and Italy, Switzerland. Insane. Well, we've got a fairly easy draw, I'd say, to get to the final. we got to make it now. we got to make it. We're going to do the normal simulation, and if we're struggling, we'll hop in and save the situation. Hey, we've made it 1-0 already. Immobile is scoring. Let's go. Easy, boys. Easy. I think we can wing it. We're going to just jump the result. Oh, it was close. It was close. It was close, but we're in a final with Italy. Let's go. Had to be Germany in the finals for the Euros. Uh, Germany beat Portugal 2-0. Italy, Germany. This is going to be insane. Let's take a look at the stats of the tournament so far. Thomas Muller with six in six games. You can always bank on him scoring in the Euros or any international tournament for that matter. Yo, Switzerland went on a dream run. Mertens did fairly well. Immobile with four. Nabri with four assists. We're going to be, have to be careful of those guys. Immobile has had a fantastic tournament, by the way. Fair enough. Oh, Verratti is injured. Just like in real life, guys, Verratti is injured. So I think for the final, we'll play Locatelli. Yeah, I, th I think, yeah, we'll switch them around. So you guys wanted to see Locatelli in action? That's going to happen now. It's the Euros final. Italy, Germany. Is this going to happen in real life? I don't know. It's at Wembley as well. So that's a good touch. Also, look at the Germany lineup. This is what they've been using in real life. I know they're playing a three at the back, but this is weird. Really weird. Nabri, Muller out wide, Werner's in there, of course. That's our team, though. We're keeping it simple, a 4-3-3. Immobile, Chiesa, Locatelli, who's been one of the standout players in real life. Let's do it, boys. Here we go, guys. Euros final, Italy, Germany. Is this going to happen in real life? I don't really think so. My bet is still on France reaching the final. Italy could be there, but I'm definitely going with France in the final. We'll see, we'll see, though. But should be a fun game here for us. Varela. Locatelli, Insigne, this is our chance. How Neuer saved that, I have no idea. That's Neuer for you. In a final, of course, he steps up. That's mad. Ah, uh, Werner, big, big block from Chiellini, man. On both ends, we're seeing legends of this game. Chiellini and Neuer just step up for their countries. Mental. Insigne, look at the pace. Oh, the ball's actually decent. I thought he wasn't going to make it. Oh, what a pass for Locatelli. And Locatelli, even in game, manages to score in a Euro final. Locatelli won. Germany nil. 1-0 nil Italy. What a goal from him as well. The power behind that shot was, was really nice. No, I couldn't stop it. Italy 1-0 up. Just what we need. Let's have a look at the replay on this because it was a really well-worked goal. That pass from Insigne was, was nice. Back heel again. Solid finish. Solid, solid finish from Locatelli. Let's go. Half time, guys. And um, we're doing well. 1 0 up. Few chances for Germany here and there. But I think overall we've coped with it well. Let let's get the job done in the second half. Here goes the little man. Insigne. Immobile. Flicks it up once. Ah, didn't really do anything with that attack. Oh, here we go with Chiesa. Chiesa from distance. Oh, oh what an attempt from Federico Chiesa. Does he start for Italy? I'm not entirely sure. I think Berardi plays ahead of him, but I really think Chiesa should be starting. Neuer with the save. Cruz, if we concede now, it'll not be fair because I think we've been better. Tony Cruz looks for Timo Werner. Back in for Cruz. You just knew it was going to happen. You just knew this was going to happen. Tony Cruz scores for Germany and it's 1-1. Could this game go to extra time? Uh, maybe. I, I, I think so. Werner was class there. Fair enough. Oh, Immobile with strength. Immobile. Immobile, superb. Shoots. Oh, what a goal from Immobile. That could win us the Euros. What a strike. Let's go. The strength there to hold off the two defenders was unreal. Immobile, what a goal. Come on. Look at the replay here. Like, he just shrugged off a couple of defenders, just moved away from them, no chance, and then bang. No, I couldn't stop it. 2-1 up. Okay, Werner. Okay, this is this is not good. It's the top scorer of the tournament. Chiellini is not having it, whether he's top scorer or not. And we could do something here. Locatelli driving it forward. Go on. Long ball for Immobile. Can he get there? Can. Stretching the play. Ah, oh, come on. I gave it away cheaply. We shouldn't be doing that. Okay, this is bad. This could be bad. Werner. No, no, no. Chiellini has put in a man of the match shift tonight. What a performance. There you have it, guys. We've won the Euros with Italy. Not too shabby, I'd say. I want to see if we've got like any new trophy celebrations with this mod. 
Or is it the same thing? Maybe we do have, I'm not sure. That's probably very difficult to code into the game, I guess. But hey, let, let's enjoy the celebrations. I, I, I was talking about this with the chat about rating this mod out of 10. If there was a way to have it in career mode as well, like integrating it with the club football experience, I'd give this mod a 10 out of 10. But unfortunately, it's only there for like a tournament mode. So that's a bit of an L. But I'd say it's a solid 7 because all the licenses are there. The kits are there. The menus look absolutely beautiful with the Euros team. And with that, I think we're going to wrap up today's video. Uh, hopefully it was a fun one for you guys to watch. I think I should, if I remember, I'll have the link for this mod in the description. But if you guys have enjoyed this one, I'd really appreciate if you could drop a like on the video. Subscribe as well if you are new around here for more content like this. FIFA 21, 22 soon as well. And um, yeah, Chiellini lifts the trophy and with that we end off the video.